So welcome back to more Train Simulator gameplay with gameplay number 8 now. Uh, you join me on Rapid Transit once again. Uh, pretty much uh, on the fourth route now. And pretty much almost at the end of this scenario. So yeah, uh, so we're actually just about there now. Uh, almost done this scenario. So we're in the per Permontement um, route now. I think I'm running so okay for one to went uh, before the final bit to do now, so hopefully this will be fun. Wit suckers our next one to do now. We did not bind in the last video, which was a 30 minute wit, and now we're in wit sucker, wit sweet swipe. We've actually got a tandem set this time around by lots of things on the on the wee thumbnail, so that should be even that be should be pretty fun. So let's uh, get ourselves into it now. So again, hopefully you guys are doing well, hopefully you're still enjoying, as I say each video now, I hope you're enjoying Train Sim World. I will get back in the truck and <coughs> I will get back in the train trucks and bus simulators again, you know, get back in there, I just want to do this again, you know, do some more Train Sim World, you know, where's our train? It's a bit of a... Bit of a, a bit of an overcast morning. We're sort of even waiting on the train, or we train up there. Why train up there? We need to go all the way under the overpass where we train there. This is this is not usually the way we go any. Slightly different direction. If the elevator actually works, that would be quite cool. You know, don't think it does. Yeah, we've got. Let me just check. We actually have got two. We actually have got a tandem set and connected in this route. So we actually got a six car instead of a three car. Just coming up the stairs. Get cells all set up once again. Pretty much the same, the same old. I guess you know now by now this game. In a way, you know same seat. All I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the cabin lights off because it looks slightly better when it's off, even if it's dark, even if it's dark outside. It, why not just turn them off? Because it looks better. I'm going to try and get the screen back to the, the blue contrast brightness. Does that do anything? It's contrast, isn't it? If I can find it, it's quite a. Uh, oh, there I had it there. Tiny wee, tiny wee um, thing way. There we go. That's what we want. Eh? Got the megaphone once again. Looking at the megaphone. I love it. Remember this that's down here is the mad stretch for your windscreen wipers. As I say, if I, if I say in the videos before, I want to use my wipers. Right, so you go down here to turn your wipers on and off. There's no any. Anywhere to turn the dash on. Lock the doors. Oh, I can lock it here as well, I suppose. That's actually a better way to do that. Let's get ourselves on the go now. Don't think we can do the high tone. Yeah, a bit of a overcast day, not not the nicest. But anyway, hopefully not rain. So down here. Somehow. There we go. If we take it on. It's like a chuck on there. Oh, we actually maxing it. Yeah, a hundred. Bring it on. <laughs> Full speed ahead once again. So yeah, I in the last video was pretty much talking about um, class six dates, and you know, I went over a bit. I went a bit more sporadic once again. You know, class six dates. You know, sad you you like using as it's known as the six dates, and I was talking about you know a bit more British way again. You know. And a bit of Yule Star, a bit of that again. I mean, if 
I mean, they should actually bring the Class 68 to train some well, that's way. That actually would be really cool. As I said, this Class 68 is probably one of the... As I said in the previous video, I was saying it was probably one of the... One of the... One of the probably one of the more impressive diesels to come out in the century, I guess, because I know you don't get any beefy sounding diesels apart from like class 37, 47, the 68 still have a beefy sound and I say, said in the last video I feel like it was purposely made to do that but you know I don't know don't know anything about the 68 just to know how they work and you know I know it's got a big caterpillar engine on it so it's, it's kind of you know that's that in massive engines obviously you know powering away let's slow down yeah coming up to a first stop actually I've been wondering if I'm actually going to get there for Before I actually, before I actually overrun that again, overshoot it. I mean, it's the big platform, isn't it? When it works the things. So, it's a big platform. No, it's not actually what it's going to be. I thought it was going to be bigger. That's the quite perfect stop in there, that was actually not too bad. That's some external shots once again. Let's stay and not talk about Quest 6 dates in this video. Yeah, we've got a tandem set today. Are the headlights actually on? Should be on in that front unit, eh? I haven't checked them. Yeah, they're fine. I've got a foot driving mode, that's probably better. Yeah, nice train, hey. Nice to have tandem set with us this time around. Tandem sets aren't very common. Look what they do is. Get ourselves up in the up and running once again. Full steam ahead. Obviously not full steam ahead, but full power ahead I guess. Going to bring this, we're going to get some good speed of this train again up to 100 for most of the part. Another another route I was always thinking it could come train somewhere else. I'll say as I'm from Scotland, as is, as you can probably tell, they should bring the Edinburgh to Glasgow main line to the train somewhere. Else. I know that route's kind of a decent length, I guess, to do. It's not too long, it's not too short, you know, it's it's probably just light for this sort of game, you know. Because I think the thing is, with Train Sim World, I think they can only make so long, so much effort and so make the lines as, not as long, but you know, get some rehorn, got a fail train, train driver coming past us. Uh, yeah, make it, make it just the light length, you know. Not too long, not too short, and um, I think the grass school to end the main line would be another possibility to come, another potential route to come in the game. That's just my opinion. Wind turbines, I've not seen them before. Got lots of turbines, they're not spinning actually, it's not really windy, yeah. They're not really on, they're not really on hull, so you know, they're just sitting there, just static there. Yeah. Uh, turn that out, it's turn the power down a little bit here. Yeah. Right, so it's still light down anyway. I'll bring the train to a max on the speed and then you'll actually have to slow down again. I'm coming in a bit fast, I think. I think it'll be fine. Yeah, I think. 
potentially inverted rascal, meaning why would that actually be an offer to to come to the game? I don't know yet on that one, but I feel I feel my opinion that's going to be a very great one. That actually be quite a decent one to come. We can just only we can just only hope. Eh? Probably, probably, probably be on right way just now, but in the future, because it's not too on a, not too on a way anyway. Not, not, not too on. It's probably similar to what we're doing t on this route, to be honest. Just a regional, just like a, a regional train route. It's not. And not not a very long one. I mean, they can probably do one. They can probably do like which that about thirty miles at least. So so where they can put in the Glasgow main line. And I mean that would be great actually, because then they can add in some British Scott Rail trains as well. Some they can add maybe the class three three eight five, the class the class M one seven zero turbo star. That would be another opportunity to grab some more British units in the game. I don't know if that would come, but but we can just see what happens. Eh? Pay the wait. We'll just have to play the waiting game. Only hope if Dovetail does do that, then that's that'll be that be um that be pretty much saying I'll just be up my street pretty much having the Ember to Glasgow wing in Chainsaw World or in Chainsaw World 3 as I say probably because that's the current one not the original one because I think the original one's also you know it's not going to any updates I don't think anymore so I reckon then the world will make the new the world put Glasgow to Ember main line in the new game they actually did put the Glasgow the Kafka Circle line and train some world that's way with the case with the class three some the class three three one four isn't it? They did actually do a grass go line, circle line, so they actually could do the grass go um, the main line, so I've forgotten about that one but then it just spun my mind right literally just at that moment that they do they did actually do a grass go one with a Scott Rail class three one four. You know, they just need to. The only thing is, they just need to make a an ember to grass school line. Just, just move, just in head probably east rather than than the circle line. But you know, that is a start anyway. And then they might add three one, three one. Is it three one, three two ones or something? You call them as well, or three twenties? Maybe class three twenties. Uh, you know the. The kind of somewhere I think they kind of call them nickname. I think they call them. I think they call them like uh, bin trains or something because they look quite. They look like bins or something. I don't know why. I've heard that name get mentioned somewhere. I have not. I haven't really got a clue on that one, but you know it's. Yeah, I feel like I have a. I have a feeling that. Uh, the grass go to Ember line to come. In the future, for sure. And another line I always think it would be even better as well. I don't know if it'll be a, I don't think it'll be a positive outway. As it might be too long to see. This is actually quite a long platform again. Yeah, another one would be quite tempting. Well, I don't know if it will be tempting, but I reckon I really want to try and see these close green line come to the game. You know, have the Clash 91s included. I always think that's another. That would be right up my street as well. So, like Edinburgh towards London, 
it might be too long, but they did it in train simulator, didn't they? I'm pretty sure in train simulator they have these course main line crashing ones. But in train simulator, it's a whole different story, isn't it? Because it's only it's only um, optimized for the console, eh? It's not very it's not really um, probably not really suitable as for that sort of thing at the moment, you know. But I've I always like to see some some nice more Scottish groups come to the game, you know. Even the Vice Circle line, you know. And I was just talking about it's in the last video but the six dates going along. Include the six dates, you know. Just just um do that as well, you know. I just have to we'll just have to see, eh? More German routes maybe as well. I think Germany is probably more like a more likely chance. I'm pretty sure they would have like developers that are you know developing games, you know, like Webit games and stuff they're developing for now third party studios and that so like developers on Germany might put put the German roots in. And developers from you know from America, they would put the American roots in. I don't know how it works actually. But I mean they do they do make some impressive trains. I mean this is probably the best train simulator game you get so far. I mean you know, like train, train somewhere it's obviously um, kind of outdated now on the PC. It's, I mean, it still looks good, I guess, but it's come to that to say everything looks, it looks a bit old school now. But they can add all the full length, I guess, you know, all the full length roots, I guess, on that, on that game. Like a one to one scale, you know. Well, see, it's not as, um, it's also not as in higher ways as this game is, I guess. Everything is a bit more up to date in a way. Most of it is the assets in the game, you know, pantographs. They are still popping in a little bit, aren't they? But, you know, it's things like that. It's also this game's last gen, so that's the reason why everything's kind of popping in. And in a way, is swapping in. We're taking this bro again, aren't we? I didn't know. But I think we're heading into the tunnels again. Yeah, I'm probably optimised for last gen consoles this game is, so that's the reason why it's like this. Ourselves in. Get this one in quite neatly, actually. Talking about these doors. Let's get some externals again. So, yeah, we've got a tandem set, so even having that in the platform now, we can stop flow up a little bit. Yeah, I'm not really sure doing much of this train once again, eh? Let's have a look at the doors shutting again. We'll see everything going, we'll see the we we'll see the, the board going in as well, the rebel board in. Obviously this is not a fret at all, as I was saying. Not not a not a fret, it's a isn't a fret as you wonder a Sandra fret, it's a Bombardier talent too. Yeah we could ah, you can see that goes down. Goes in, doesn't it? It's going to kill that. I wonder if we had like um, rebel wooden trains, you know, in the UK. It's not a common thing, apart from you know what we've got the the, the threats that have been ordered in Great Anger. I believe they're the the first rebel wooden trains to come in the UK. And also, when um, is it Merseyrail? They actually got they actually replacing their. Uh, the 50 
eights and five or five or sevens and five or eights, I guess, so fins frets as well, aren't they? The white sad sad wear. Maybe it's not fret actually. Yeah, but they are built by sad wear. So they are quite a lot of trouble there, the class treble sevens, aren't they? Like yeah, they're like the the wasps or the bee trains because they're yellow and black. Maybe give her the nickname that. I forgot my son down again here. Yeah. yeah, the bee the bee train or the wasp train is it known as that's how I call it. The triple sevens none of us none of us had to have a real product. But I don't know if it's a fruit or not. The same puns as well, I guess, but I don't know, it's a bit more of a flat out front on the on the triple sevens compared to the seven eight the seven the class the class then seven four five and seven five five. Uh, the seven seven the class seven 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 is a bit more of a flat out front front than a rounded one. It's not very really a high speed one eh, so Merseville, I guess Merseville is like a kind of like you know, great in Merseyside to Fiverpool and that you know, all that area. When this and un when under the city tunnel again, it's to be fun. Try and get in a bit better. Eh? Guess we've got a longer train so. Made sense not to stop uh, too soon. Uh, these doors. Let's break this down now again. Uh, you can see that going out here. Let's go. Oh. It's a bit great to see the camera. I guess it goes a bit berserk. It goes a wee bit berserk sometimes, the camera. Let's have a look at the, the door shutting again. Let's see the level boarding. It's not quite there in this station, isn't it? It's a wee bit way off here, but you know. Oh, is it way off? I don't know what's going on. So this camera, they're not too fond of it. That is the platform, isn't it? It's not quite off there. It's fine. Yeah, there's the platform there, it's it's pretty much over boarding, isn't it? That's where you kill that eh? Maximum power again. Get back in the driver's seat again. Put the headlights on a bit higher beam now because we're getting in these tunnels. I'm not going too far here. Crafting mat is here, I think. Right? Coming a bit past here, I think. No, I think we're going to be alright, actually. But it was coming a bit quick there. <laughs> That was quite that was quite perfect that one. Not like frame bust some of it, you know, perfect stop in position. You know, it's not exactly in this game. I'll probably stop like a mile off, probably in the tunnel and I'll stall I'll stall when tell me I'm up the doors. You know. Let's go back. Oh and the cameras. It's perfect this part for me. Look at that. Pretty cool, eh? It's pretty cool. Most trains should have this sort of feature, you know. UK trains should have more like level wood and platforms, you know. You know, it's a bit of a step to get off the train. Most of the trains here, isn't that? Completely fine, Germany. I reckon there's much of trains here as well. Let's see that come back in again, eh? It's cool. Uh, 
back in this AOC again. Get some horn from the tunnel. Gonna be a bit thorough, but we're gonna be stopping that too as soon as we get to the max speed. The permit out speed of our gonna survive anything. It's uh, the big fancy gas, gas station once again. Let's have a look at the doors again. There we go. It goes up, comes out again and then it opens. That's cool. I really like this. It's very nice of me. I mean, I see it's ugly. I see it it's ugly at the front, but you know, I think it's good as a as a as a modern street train tool for all the tech and that. You know, accessible train. You know, obviously you've got steps going up to the to the steps to the to the seats. Obviously, but you know, obviously, it's obviously something like that. You know. And it's just the three cameras, isn't it? Yeah, let's have a look at this camera. I've not really used this camera very often. Let's have a look at some... Have a wee bit of a... Uh, look at the departure of the chain. That's cool, eh? Let's get ourselves back in the driver's seat again. We get to we get to the speed we get to and we'll stop again. Coming up to the next station. They're right too small. Actually, they're all quite near each other. The stations in the tunnel. To the pencil one again. So we can more stand of these again. Those are um, open. Might as well get the train in perfect. It's quite close there. You know, that's not really not really doing very well with camera. Yeah, just, yeah, nice, nice train, keep staying. Next station. Next station is actually outside the tunnel, isn't it? Maybe a couple more stations to go, but yeah, I think we'll just be about finishing this route, going up the steep hill once again. Let's just hit the tunnel again. Got to 50, yeah. That's just still down again. I think this is quite a long platform, isn't it? It's a bit more to go on this platform. These doors again. Yeah, 
Yeah, I have this as I say, I hope you guys are liking this train and enjoying the German loops. I'll also try and do some more Brettas again, eh? I'm going to try and do the Class 66 in one of these videos, eh? I said then um, before, I was going to try and do a 66 route, do a freight route, eh? This should bring some more freight routes as well, you know, there's not many freight routes in this game. You know, this should obviously bring us a, a passenger route and German route, but it should bring us a freight route as well, not just have the, ta the, the talent to included this should have a freight weight as well, you know. It's always good to bring some more trains, you know. That's the thing, eh? I don't know if they will bring any more any free weights in this game also but you know on his head right saying down a little bit. Yeah, I like to yeah, I like, with a nice to drive some white freight German freight trains as well. Most most of the passenger trains are driving in Germany, but there's freight trains in Germany. I think in some of the some of the DLCs there's some freight trains, German freight trains. I'd like to see some more German trains come to the game, you know. I mean Germany's always fighting much, it's even the UK and it's Germany and U USA seems to be the most routes that come in. It's never anything far afield, you know, like, you know, like Italian trains or something. You know, this would fling a... They have a Swiss, they have Swiss routes, don't they? I bet it's still down here. They actually do have a um, uh, Rosal line, don't they? And you've got one of the narrow gauge Swiss trains. Uh, the Rosal line. It's pretty cool. It's a DLC as well. That's one of the Swiss routes. In fact, they have a, they do have a fret, didn't they? And what they, do actually, they, do, they, they did actually have a fret, a fret, and fret come to train some well recently as well. So there's actually a threat in this and train symbol, but not as a DLC. But usually, most of the time, you get um, routes and train symbol. It's not mere. It's not mere. Uh, sometimes it's namely a, 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 a train and then there's a route included, I think. But not all the time, eh? I know they did the diesel legends, that's gave you class 52 and. Western and they gave us the 58, no not 58, Crash 08 and they gave us a, must have been a, is it a, it's a Crash 08 and I think it was another one, I don't remember what the other one was again, Crash 47, Crash 31 maybe, and they actually have the steam trains as well, they actually have the, and Spirit of Steam, don't they? Is it Spirit of Steam I'm calling it? That one, they actually do have steam trains in this game now. Or not in this one, obviously, but in, train, in the, the DLC, obviously. And they do actually have steam trains. I mean, they do. They seem to be getting everywhere trains them well, don't they? Obviously brought us the... They obviously brought us another... Another... And... I'm not another train as well, they actually have the Isle of, Isle of um, White as well, the class, um, class 484 as well, the G-Stock, I've got that included as well. They have a couple more stuff there as well, they actually have the original one there as well, the class 483 as well, the old um, 1938 tube stop, they actually have that as well. Bring some like more subway subway and routes as well. Glasgow subway would be another, another potential route as well. As I said about calf calf uh, circle line as well. Calf cat is it calf cat I'm thinking it's that it's that one of the I was saying earlier the circle line. It's to bring the Glasgow subway to train some world. That would be that would be as good as the channel tunnel route I was saying before. 
I'm coming to the next station already. Uh, it was to bring us that to the game as well. I'm coming in here a bit too fast. Um, I'm going to overrun this. Yes, <laughs> that's my first overrun. I wonder if the train will accept the doors. Yeah, apparently it has. <laughs> Let's have a wee look. <laughs> How are they going to get out <laughs> at this side? <laughs> they're actually going to get out of the platform in this unit, and they have to get out in this side on the unit. They have to. They have to be on. The, no one. The the they're a bit unlucky in this unit because they have to. They have to get out the plat. They have to get off. The, out the, not get on on the platform. But the this one's this one's quite. This one's lucky. Or this one's on the platform. So. Yeah, there's my first overrun there of the day. So over overshoot, as you say, that's what you call it, overshoot. Overshoot it there. Never thought that would happen. Oh no, I just unlocked the doors again. I have to unlock that as well. Get that one as well. There we go. Just a bit unlucky there. You know, that's what I'm doing when I'm talking too much here. I mean, you don't pay attention, you get off, you get, you sort of daydream, you're not actually coming to your next station, which we just, and then you don't see it. You don't break in time. We're coming to our next station, which we which we just around the corner now, so I'm literally going to not even get up to speed here. I can probably get to speed and then put the brakes on wheel. Yeah, probably probably won't get too fast this one. That was a mistake there yeah, that I did. <laughs> Yeah, and Grass, as I say, as I was saying, as I was saying Glasgow Subway. This is playing the Glasgow Subway to Train Sim World. I mean, yeah, Train Sim World, uh, to bring Glasgow Subway to it, because that would be another potential route. I definitely would get. Hopefully it does come, because then they have their London Underground in Train Sim World too, so. I don't know, I know if they've worked in the Kafka line. And we start the DLC, you know, they would do some more Scottish routes, wouldn't they? I just like them to see them. I just really want them to see them do some more routes up in Scotland, eh, rather than focusing on Germany. And I mean, they do focus on UK as well, so you're still getting UK routes, but you just need to get so much German routes these days, don't you? So it's there, sort of, I mean, sort of like second to none, yeah, it's always a German route. And it's always a... what's going on here? Just give it a minute, I think I went on too soon there. They gave us, the army gave us German locomotives, I think the last um, locomotive bundle DLC we've got quite recently had has an American train, as a German train, as a, as a British train. That seems to be the only thing to see me. Um, most of the time, when we get Japanese trains as well, <laughs> I think that might be a hard one. Maybe, maybe they're quite easy. Easy. Maybe these ones are quite easy to. I think the Japanese stuff will be hard to get in the game. I think it'd be hard to license a lot of them. That would be potential. You no, know, I like some of the Japanese trains. They're quite cool as well. I like to see a bullet train. I like to see some of the some of the freight trains in Japan as well. They have some wicked freight trains. Like they don't have like their own container train. I mean, they have like their own container stuff there. You know, they do have freight trains in Japan, but they're not very long. They're not heavy freight trains. Just um, they're pretty short, but I mean, they they have like beautiful. Beautiful white jet locomotives as well. 
I mean, I don't really know my Daphne's trains as well. It's the same. Probably the probably the, the nicest then um, electric train in Japan has. There's a diesel. I mean, there's a. I know it's the bullet trains. Obviously, most you would see, because obviously they look very futuristic. Yeah, they're they're very they're very OTT. A lot of the bullet trains in Japan. But I do like some of the potent and um, compensal trains in Japan as well. Just their their regional trains, their freight trains in Japan. But yeah, there's this beautiful electric locomotive. I know it's like a boxy electric locomotive in Japan. I like to see that come to the game. I mean, I don't think even know what, what I'm even saying about what this electric locomotive is, because I'm not really. I'm just saying I like, I just don't know electric locomotive because there's loads of electric trains in Japan. I think most of the trains in Japan are probably more efficient because they have a lot more electric stuff in Japan as well as much as Germany. Yeah, I'll say Japan obviously most of their trains have to be on time, don't they? I think apparently I think they have to be apparently they would get fined I guess if they are not on time apparently in Japan I think the trains I'm not sure but I think that's something. I mean I don't know anything about Japan trains the the obviously I know they have like their own I know they have Japanese wheel wheel freight. This is uh freight this is in I really like them to I really like Japanese I really want to see Japanese trains come to this game as well. We actually come to the end of the week I guess because we're in a red. It's coming up to nine and they're coming down here as well. 19. So I'm right down here. It's generally so right down to 25. Somehow that's strange. Yeah, I don't know what 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 they'll bring. It might be hard to bring Japanese stuff in the game. You know, could be a potential thing in the future. Japanese trains are great looking trains, as I say, you know, something that could, obviously could have them, but we'll just have to pray, we'll just have to wait on that one, you know. We're just sort of coming to a weird station here, aren't we? It's just a few bit power here. I thought we were in a side in here. Now we're fine. Now we are then. I hope you have enjoyed a bit um, more train similar. I hope you have enjoyed me waffle on once again. Not waffle on about this train as much. Waffle on about Japanese trains and British trains, you know. Scottish trains, Scottish routes, you know. Yeah, I really like to see the more of the Scots routes come more than the Japanese stuff, you know. I like to see that come more. That's just finished. So it's going to just tell me to send back the train again, so... Of course, I should actually shut the doors, that's the way. What they do is... It's going to be funny enough and turning this enough. This door, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I really like to see yeah more of the Scots routes come. Like Glasgow Subway and the Glasgow to Ember main line. But anything maybe maybe what's the first mile? <laughs> that's where that's cool. Run the first mile. Run the first mile. <laughs> it's the only way. That's that finished. 
once again another one done and dusted another another rapid transit done and dusty once again so and um, we're doing quite well I uh, hope you have enjoyed that one next video will be the final the final wait in the next video for sure the final scenario I should say not the wait so we're doing to cross town so it's lots of sorts that one involving it's somewhere far away what we've been doing before I guess you know I kind of know the weights of it now don't I so you know it's not that hard to do them now uh, so yeah again it's been good to bring these videos to the channel once again Um, change some world anyway I won't waffle on too long as as I say hopefully with Hopefully we might get another squad suite in the game. We'll have to see on that, yeah. But yeah, bring it on. Bring it on. We'll get some get some men class class three eight fives and class one seven zeros and class one five eights. I know they've got a class one then right enough, they actually have a class one fifty, don't they? And the corners route, don't they? They actually do have a class one fifty. So Potentially we could get a class one one five six and a one five eight and a one and a class one seven zero come to train some world in the future. I really like to see that, but you know, I was obviously going to just play the waiting game, I guess, on that. But I know if they have the calf car circle line, calf cat as a calf cat, I'm trying to pronounce it properly, or the grass go circle line is you know as it's as it known as and. Um, you know, they should bring some, they have the Scott Rail, obviously, whether we are that, so see where they'll get some more Scott Rail trains to come, and another Scott Rail route, another Scottish route. Even the West Highland, West, West, West Highland one would be actually even better as well, you know, that could be another one. That's just a, that's just a single line that goes up to Fort William and that, you know, stuff like that. So a lot of things they could bring to the game, you know. But you know, at the end of the day, we just have to see whatever happens. And it's like the Channel Tunnel will probably have to have to wait wait on the future for that. But you know, maybe wait on the PS6 for that or that so even because that take it probably be too much to optimize it. But yeah, it might work out. You never know. Anyway. I won't waffle on. I hope you have enjoyed this video once again. I hope you enjoyed a bit more rapid transit. Uh, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And as I say before, and um, podcast will be in the search and bots below to check out. Um, if you want to listen to me interviewing bands, it's on it's in the search and bots. It's completely different, you know. Podcast something. I'm going to really fire up, fire off, and all sounders in the future is the podcast. So, so at least you'll actually see me in the videos as well because it's a video podcast. So you'll actually see me interviewing bands, which is very cool. So, and the sets and boxes the podcast. So check that out. And yeah, and of course the playlists on the video will be there as well. Any any of my other stuff you can check out there as well. And yeah, I'll be back um, for the final final week of Rafa Trans in the next video. So bye for now.